Good afternoon. This is Chris Brecher with Brecher Trading. Free Friday video, May 4th, the night of the Apple Runner. Like I said, I'm inspired a lot by the old Wild Wild West shows that I used to watch with my best friend from Dothan, Alabama. And so a lot of times I like doing banners like this that looks like the beginning of the lead-in show for Wild Wild West. So just keep that in mind today. So what was today all about? Today was about Apple. And Apple has a giant buyback program. And the key in there is they have a buyback program that was accelerated. Now, they just announced an extra 100 million, uh, 100 billion in a buyback. But their present buyback, they have to buy back by June. Now, that's a big deal because there aren't that many days left to buy between 10 and 20 billion shares. So the deal in Apple was every day it seems to rally right on the opening uh, in anticipation of this. And today was no different. Now, why is that important in there? Well, number one, this was the gap from earnings. This was how it closed yesterday. It gapped up today because Warren Buffett said he was also buying stock. The key in there is that strength filtered to the overall market. Now, what do I mean by that? That's why a lot of times I say similar charts have similar results. This is the NASDAQ on the left. Now, you can't tell yet which way the NASDAQ was going to go. Forget about the bar today. But you go and take a 30-minute chart in here, and you see this big, beautiful bull flag. Well, it looked like we were going to roll to the downside pre-opening today prior to the unemployment report. But this strength in Apple was enough to power this above here. Now, I'm going to take this on a shorter-term chart to show you. So the second we got above here, this also meant you got above that. And now that's a big old bull flag that projects at least 120 points. That 120 added to 6660, uh, 6660 gets you to 6780, exactly where we closed. Now, what's interesting about that is put the NASDAQ on the left and now go put the ESs on the right. Any of these uh, similar charts, you know, you might say, well, of course that looks like an inverse head and shoulders. We call that a Stewie pattern at uh, Brecher Trading as it sort of looks like Stewie from Family Guy. But you have to understand, not so fast. This is where a lot of traders don't do well. What they do is they see this and they see the NASDAQ going up. They're like, but I know this is going down. That's not the way to look at it. It's all about escape velocity. When the NASDAQ had reached the escape velocity, like getting out of our Earth's atmosphere, so to speak, um, that was a tell that this was going to work on the upside. That's why a lot of people are averse to buying here. I mean, uh, that try to buy on the way down and get hurt. You buy on the way up. That was good for 30 points on the ES. Now, just keep in mind, we're looking at these me measuring objectives. So keep that in mind of what we're looking at in there. So and what we're seeing in here is the measuring objective. The measuring objective is 2590 to 2630, 40 points. We went up 40 points. The key in there is when that happens, you look for good chart patterns. Now, you might say, but they already went up. When this was consolidating prior to breaking up, you still had a chance for it. You still had a chance to buy stocks. So let me show you some of them we were buying today. Electronic Arts. Look like a nice little bull flag in here. And I'll show you what we were doing. A lot of people asked, hey, if you think we're going up, what do you buy? And I said, you'd buy the stocks that are the most volatile that have bull flags. The key in there is if this is going to go up enough, obviously it's going to pull everything up. You want to buy the stocks that already have good chart patterns. Electronic Arts worked. A lot of the NASDAQ stocks worked. So keep in mind something like Facebook. Facebook had this beautiful bull flag right here. Well, I'm not even sure you call that a bull flag, but you call that the more times you can connect the dots on a trend line, the more important. The minute that that broke to the upside, that was good for about two and a half points. Those are the type of easy trades you try to find in there. So that's one thing about our uh, site is trying to find easy trades. Now for next week, there are a lot of trend lines that are going to be in play here. Uh, just to keep in mind on the actual videos for Brecher Trading, we'll go over the specific ideas. But if you want to know what I'm watching in the back of my mind, it's going to be this. A four-hour chart on the left of the ESs and a four-hour chart of the NASDAQ. And you can see the trend lines I'm going to be watching. 
those trend lines. And that will determine, do you draw it like this or like this? I think you draw it like that. If that's true, you're going to have some more upside and you're going to have to look for long ideas. Now, just to let you know, you're not getting off that easy of uh, getting a free video. You got to endure me talking about Brecher trading in the site. Right now, we have a $5, uh, $5 10-day uh, trial. As you see, the trial is only $5. We've made a ton of money on a lot of these trades day in and day out since I started the site. So just keep in mind for $5, you've got a real-time chat room, morning ideas, forum, videos, learning center, and special events. Now, let me center in on what we do in here. So number one, the most important thing on our site is the chat. I'm on at least an hour in the morning, an hour in the afternoon, but I'm monitoring all day. I'm not going to play golf or anything, going to travel to some foreign country or something. And then I put the, far, the chat replays in here. Now, the reason I mentioned that I'm in there all day, if I see something funky happening intraday, I'll jump back on the chat. I have never seen another site where so many people stay on the chat even when I'm not talking, just anticipating if I get on. So that's pretty exciting in there. So the chat is a big deal. As you see here, here's the schedule. The next thing we have in here that's very important are the morning ideas. Every morning I put out at least five index charts and five stock charts, and these things have been kicking in gear. As you see in here, the May 4th morning ideas work great. So this comes in a format where you can just click through them real quick. And you'll see, you click through them. Boom, 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 boom. Works great in here. The last thing in here that uh, I think is important, there are two things extremely important. One is the videos. So every night I do a video similar to this, except it's a lot more in depth and features specific stock ideas and, and index ideas and futures ideas. I'll go and trade gold, crude oil, Bitcoin, whatever looks good. So we have our nightly videos, as you see right here. Swing trade videos, every weekend I put out some uh, either longer term ideas or overall market perspectives. They've been working really well. And then I have learning videos. A lot of people charge for every one of these. These are free as long as you're a member. All in here, trading setup, ATR trailing stop, MACD. My favorite candlestick patterns. How to set up tweet deck. I love to show that. That's a big deal. And the other thing we have in here is we have an active forum where people can ask questions to everyone. But this has been the biggest hit, uh, a huge hit. I'm so surprised. I do every Thursday, every other Thursday night from 7 to 7 p.m. Eastern, I do an Ask Me Anything. So for uh, a number of subscribers that can't be there all day, I stay on and do this. What you'll find interesting the one from yesterday was 52 minutes. I'll stay on as long as you're asking me questions. I love to answer questions about the stock market. So just keep that in mind. Uh, you get a lot for your money in this. I've been doing it 38 years, and we've kept everybody on the right side of the market almost every day since I started this site January 4th. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Everybody have a great night. I hope you can take us up on the trial. Um, take care.